Uh, Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai Bashem, Makar Kadash. Shalom to the uh, elders, Wa'akim Wa'akwaf, and I say Shalom. In the Heavenly Father, true name is Yahweh, and His only begotten Son, Bahashem, in the name of Mashiach, Yahweh Those are their true names in the ancient Paleo Hebrew, uh, the Lashwan Kadash, the Holy Tongue. And Shalom to the uh, elders, Wa'akim Wa'akwaf, once more, and I say Shalom. And this is a uh, sit-down lesson that I want to bring up of this news, uh, recent news article from the time of Israel.com as of January the 24th, 2024. It says, live updates from the live blog as of Monday. And it reads, it says, rockets uh, target American forces in Syria after a deadly uh, Jordan attack, says U.S. official from the AFP today at 10 24 p.m it says american and allied forces in syria were target with rockets to, uh, today a u.s defense official said uh after three of washington's troops were killed in a drone attack in jordan yesterday it says multiple rockets were launched against the u.s and coalition forces at a patrol base in uh Sadai Sadi. Syria, if I pronounce that right. No injuries reported and no damage to infrastructure, the U.S. defense official said. On the condition of the anonymity, referring to a installation in the north northeastern Syria, the United States have some 900 troops in Syria and 2,500 in neighboring Iraq as part of the international coalition against <clears throat> The Islamic State group, a jihad organization that once controlled swaths of both countries. <clears throat> so, okay. And this is the book of Matthew 24, verse 6. It reads, and Ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that you be not troubled for all these things must first come to pass, but then it's not yet. Matthew 24, and verse 6. For nation shall rise against nation. And kingdom against kingdom, and there shall be famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places. This is the book of Luke 21, kind of similar to uh, Matthew's cross reference scripture. This is uh, Luke 21 and verse 9. But when ye shall hear of wars and commotions, which that's what we're hearing over there in Western Asia and over there in the Red Sea, be not terrified, for these things must first come to pass, but the end is not by and by. Luke 21 and verse 10, then say he unto them, nation shall rise against nation and kingdom against kingdom. This is uh, Jeremiah. Even though this was taking place in Jeremiah's time, we can relate this into modern day times as well too. Because the scripture says, uh, Ecclesiastes 1 and verse 9, there's no new thing under the sun. This is uh, the prophet, the prophet. The prophet Jeremiah 51 and verse 46, excuse me for, uh, excuse me for repeating it. Uh, the prophet Jeremiah 51 and verse 46, it reads, it says, and leash your heart faint and ye uh, fear for the rumor that shall be heard in the land. A rumor shall uh, both come one year and after that in another year shall come a rumor and violence in the land, ruler against ruler. So with that, hopefully this uh, sit-down lesson was uh, edifying of this uh, recent news article from the time of Israel.com by FAFP today at 1024 p.m. And it reads again, it said, rockets target American forces in Syria after a deadly Jordan attack, says U.S. officials. So with that, hopefully this uh, sit-down lesson was uh, edifying. With that, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to to Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai Bashem, Akarkadash. In the Heavenly Father, true name is Yahweh, and His unbegotten Son, Bahashem, in the name of Hamashiach, Yahweh Shai. Those are their true names in the ancient Paleo Hebrew, the Lashwan Kadash, the Holy Tongue. And once again, Shalom to the uh, elders, Wa'akim, Wa'akwa. Until next time, I will say Shalom.